Hey everyone, welcome back to the Pace Studios. We're now live with Royal Canoe. Guys, thanks for being here. Thank you for having us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're gonna do um, uh, three songs off of Waver, which is coming out next year. It'll be out January 25th on Paper Bag Records, and you're gonna do three songs off of that album. Can you tell us about the first one? Uh, the first song is called Rays, and um, we wrote it. It was a very collective writing experience. Um, we uh, we are working in a kind of condo space that Michael's girlfriend's dad was very kind to let us use. And it was actually very similar to this room, now that I think about it. And um, we were playing this kind of songwriting game where um, we were just writing phrases and words on a piece of paper. And you, it wasn't like it necessarily had to be the title or a lyric, but just something you can pull and just like, what, what do you want to get from that? And I remember Brendan wrote Rays with a Z on a little piece of paper. So we pulled that piece of paper out, and this is what we ended up with. <laughs> gonna get them rays am I gonna see it flash before I
that sounds great. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Yeah, and that's um, I, the video for Raise is out in the world, right? That's public? It is, yes. It's awesome. I encourage everybody, not right this second, but as soon as this live stream ends, go check out uh, the video for Rays. There is a gold man. There is <laughs> gold band. There is, uh, it looks like you're out in Venice Beach. Maybe it's a very yeah, gold it's Venice Beach. color. It's very well done. So Thank hopefully, you. hopefully everybody gets a chance to check it out. Yeah, it was directed by a, f a friend of ours named Kevin Funk, who's just this amazing director. And we're so lucky that... For some reason, he likes to do music videos, but he's like f directs featured films and just such a talented visionary. And so he had this idea for uh, a long time for the video. And uh, then we brought the song to him. We thought it might be able to work out, and it was just a really good fit. Nice. Are you guys doing, I should have asked this offline, are you doing Living a Lie today, or is that? We're not, no. That another video yeah, for everybody. That, yeah. Dude, it's so well done. It's Yeah, it's beautiful. So you guys Thanks. are clearly a band that is paying a whole lot of attention to the, the visual aesthetic, to, to everything about the way you present yourselves in the world, and uh, it is appreciated. Thank you. Yeah, it's a tough, like sometimes you're, you know, you don't want the visuals to trump the music, and but at the same time, you know, like, I think that people just respond so much better when they have some kind of visual accompaniment to, to the song. And I know for me too, like I remember a video as much as I remember a song. Yeah. Yeah. I was, I mean, my experience of it, as you guys were sound checking Rays, I'm pretty sure the Living Alive video is here on my screen. And right. that juxtaposition was, right. was awesome also. It's like seeing a creepy gold dude every time people hear Rays. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Um, so you're doing uh, you're doing three songs off the album off of Waver, which is coming out on January 25th on Paper Bag Records. And can you tell us a little about the second one you're gonna do? Yeah, the second song is called 7776. Um, it's a really stupid title, which is we just totally accept that. We the song started actually it was a session that Matt started, and that was just the tempo. It was, it was called 75. 75 at the time. <laughs> <laughs> Very creative, guys. And then we, we sped it up a bit, but there's a part in the song where it slows down to, we sped it up to 77, the part in the song where it goes down to 76. And so that was just the session that we, we named it. And I remember the whole, the whole song is kind of about looking to the future and, uh, and feeling like maybe out if, as, as we look kind of past the current terror, maybe there's, there's something lurking that's something special lurking for us on the on the horizon and i think um it felt like something futuristic so the number 77 76 i always thought of it as kind of like a year even though it's just a really bad song name about is there, tempos. Any, is there punctuation in it anywhere or is it just the number seven seven it's, it's actually seven seven and hyphen seven seventy six yeah we initially had it just seven 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 six but then none of our friends michael was saying that none of his friends knew how to refer to the song so we're like, okay. Well, 7,700. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's if, like, okay, if, I'm done. If Chicago, <laughs> if Chicago can get away with 25 or 6 to 4, then I think that you guys oh, is are that, on the Is right. that a song? Is that, oh, God. It, it, yeah, one of their biggest songs, oh, and it makes man. zero sense until they explain I've never, it's about. I, I couldn't name a single Chicago song. Really? I can't, I can't even think. What do they even sound like? Remember at Quiz Night the other night, there was that <laughs> sweet Chicago song. Uh, what was the... Uh, they just played the bridge like during the quiz, and I couldn't quite... Grab it. It was like baby something with baby in the title. That's anyway. See, that sounds right. It's really <laughs> did well not mean to sidetrack us on this Chicago. Yeah, yeah, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, but so seventy seven seventy six. I'm very much looking forward to hearing that one. Awesome. All right, let's do it.
That's great. Thank you guys for uh, for doing it. It's a perfect vibe for for here for this log cabin in the middle of Manhattan. Yeah. Um, you are uh, so like we were saying earlier. I mean, you're obviously a band that pays attention, close attention to the visual aesthetic of what's going on, and close attention to what's happening in terms of the arrangement of the band. Um, in reading about the upcoming album Wave Rose, reading that you guys were are much more cognizant of keeping the arrangement stripped down and keeping less between. The band and the and the audience. Um, how does that uh, does that seem like we're in a good environment to uh, to communicate those songs? Yeah, I think it really is because you you know it's about it's about the the, the song as opposed to about the trappings and and the ornaments. Which I think I mean th to be honest, like that was we made efforts to do that, and I think we we also just kind of can't help ourselves, and I think that. In, in spite of that, there's still it still sounds like our band, but I think we went in with a much more a much stronger focus on trying to to make the arrangements um, kind of lead your ear towards the space around the vocals and the rhythm, and as opposed to distractions or things that you know we still have that stuff. But I think and I love the last two records, but I think that we we really um, we really made sure that. It was about the songwriting as opposed to all the stuff that goes along with that. Cool. Well, they're translating really well to me from where I'm sitting right now in this room, and that's nice. even without the, the the fancies that Bob is putting on it between us and the yeah. internet. There <laughs> are fancies, and it's it sounds amazing what uh, what they're hearing. But just sitting eight feet away from it sounds fantastic too. So thanks for coming and sharing these Thank songs you. with us. Yeah. Um, so you got one more to do off yeah. of Waver, which again, uh, the internet, if you're just joining us, Waver is out on January 25th uh, of 2019 on Paper Bag Records, and uh, these guys have shared two songs with us from it so far, and we're about to hear a third. Yeah, this song is called Peep This. Another lyric that doesn't appear in the song at all. <laughs> I think it did at one point, perhaps. Maybe. <laughs> Fast days, fresh face, keep up or you gon' feel lazy, don't leave me alone, don't leave me alone, I spy your eyes, too late, I'm caught in all disguises, won't leave you alone, won't leave you alone. 
don't let me cry Hold me up, hold me up Look in my eyes Don't let it die Hold me up, hold me up Stay by my side That sounded awesome. Thank you for coming and sharing. Um, so, uh, Music Hall of William. No, that's not true. Rough Trade was Rough last Trade, night. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Rough Trade was last night. Uh, you got four Canadian dates coming up uh, in the near future, and those are all with Begonia, a close collaborator of yours. Correct. Yeah. Um, and there are dates. Uh, I think is a, a little little bit of time off, and then headed to Western Europe to coincide with the with the release of of uh, Waver. And uh, good luck on all those tour dates. Travel safe. Uh, have a great time. And all the uh, to to everybody listening right now. Obviously, all those dates are up on the Facebook. They're up at RoyalCanoe.com. All the places you would expect to see those tour dates. So, uh, man, thanks again for sharing these songs with us. And have a great uh, rest of your day and rest of the tour. And hopefully, we cross paths again soon. Yeah, thank you for having thanks us.